Hi guys, I'm back with another gel polish mani. So before we get started, I do have on my Luxie Nail Builder Gel and one coat of Tip Dimpalicious Peel Off Base Coat. And I always use this base coat when I want my mani to last, um, especially when I go on vacation because it lasts, it's difficult, almost like Rebels, but it works. Um, so I have on Nail Attic Base Gel Polish and Cure for 30 seconds. And the color we're going to be using is Breaking Dawn and Lilac Madness by Nail Addict as well. I will also be using Posh Nail Decals. These um, decals are sweet stems. They're nice pretty purple decals. Along with um, Designer Ether Flakes from iGel Beauty. So guys just hang out with me while I do this gel polish application.
When I cut my decals out and spray them with water, I usually wait about 20, maybe 15 to 20 seconds. And um, the best way I, or the best way in my opinion, I've tried other methods, but the best way in my opinion to apply the decals is to use a nail stamper. I personally like to use the square stamper for maniology. Uh, over the round monocle stamper front that I have for maniology versus the um, my clear jelly stamper um, single nail stamper. I don't know what I was saying. I don't know why I paused there, but um, because it's more sm it's smushier, it's more pliable, so I can I feel like I can get the decal on smoother with that. Because again, um, I've always said when I do my decals, my um, hardest thing is to get the wrinkles out even though I try to use my finger and smooth that out as much as possible and I didn't need to apply anything additional to my nails to get the decal to stick I just used the um, tacky layer that's already on the gel polish after you cure Okay, y'all, I don't know what I was doing with these ether flakes, um, but I decided to, um, I thought I was going to apply them to the side of the nail where the decal was not located, but I, the sticky layer, the tacky layer was already gone, so that was kind of a waste of time. So the brush that I'm using is actually a gel polish ombre brush. I haven't used it. Um, so I was like, let me just use this. It looks like it's the right kind of texture on the brush to pick up those flakes um so once because and reason why i say it didn't stick because once i brushed it off it was gone off of the two nails with the decal but my index finger um actually to apply these you could have just dipped your finger and laid it flat in the the flakes and it would have picked right on up this was just a waste of time to put it on with the brush when i can just stick my finger in there um and also once I did that, I brushed them off before I went in and did a top coat. So I used a nail dusting brush and brushed off any excess flakes that um, was on my skin or, you know, just hanging out on my nail bed. So after um, I did that, I went in with iGel Beauty's Jewelry Gel. And my goal was to apply the rhinestone in the middle of the flower petals. But then you'll see at the end of the video, I changed my mind. And also I didn't, um, I applied a bunch of rhinestones to my thumb. I don't know what my thought process was there. But I ended up only putting three rhinestones on my thumb. A single one on my pinky that ended up moving from the middle. So that's why it's important um, when you're applying your rhinestones, do one nail at a time. But I was rushing. Um... 
when I did this mani but uh, yeah just do one nail at a time and cure in between and the IGL Beauty Jewelry Gel is a 60 second cure by the way so I end up um, moving the rhinestones just to the side of the nail and I applied a single rhinestone to my left hand and to um, my pinky and thumbnail on both hands as well guys so here is the finished look and as I mentioned uh, for my pinky the rhinestone did move and I applied three rhinestones to my thumbnails as well um, one thing that you're not supposed to do but I did I applied top, top coat on top of the rhinestones um, just so they would stick and they did um, so I hope you guys like the finished look as always once your nails cool off from being in the lamp you want to apply your favorite cuticle oil so guys thanks for watching I hope you have a great week and I will see you next week